Hi, I'm Matt Wald at the Nuclear Energy Institute. There's an important change in the electric market that's underway right now with an auction. This is an auction conducted by PJM, which manages the electric system all the way from Washington to Chicago. They manage it on a minute-to-minute -minute basis, an hour-to-hour -hour basis. This one is on a year-to-year -year basis. It's kind of obscure. Let me explain it. PJM auctions electricity, but what they're doing right now is auctioning capacity. Electricity is what lights the lights, runs the device that you're watching this video on. Capacity is the ability to make electricity. You really got to have both to have the system run smoothly. PJM has held capacity auctions for years and years. This year, though, it's a little different. They changed the rules. The change is that in order to enter the auction, you have to have a reliable source of electricity. In previous years, there have been some generators, notably natural gas that have shut down in key periods because it's too cold, there's too much demand for gas, they can't get the gas. We've got lots and lots of wind capacity, but it's often idle at high demand periods in the summer because there's not a lot of wind in the summer. This year, the rule is you get paid better if, like a nuclear plant, you can provide when called upon. Nuclear plants are highly reliable. They run about 90% of the hours in a year. Why is this important? Because in PJM, the way you decide whether to build new plants or operate the ones you have is how well they get compensated. Nuclear plants are at a disadvantage this, this, at this time. They're competing with heavily subsidized wind. They're competing with cheap natural gas. Having better compensation more appropriate to their value to the system won't solve all these problems, but it will help keep these reactors running, providing carbon-free, clean electricity day after day, year after year, when the electricity is needed most.